What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Gerald from Bank of Gerald here with another video update. It is Friday, January the 14th, 2022, around 4.30 p.m. Eastern Time. And we're going to talk about a platform called Futures Trade. Um, I'm just, I'm just kind of blown away because I'm watching the most accommodating uh, leader of a platform that I've ever seen. So before we get started in that, I want to remind everyone that I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. And I'm not your financial advisor, all right? I'm just a dude on YouTube that's showing y'all how I'm cranking out that crypto on many different platforms, nothing more and nothing less. But if you like this content, make sure you go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit the notification bell as well. Let's get into it. Y'all know I love to share my screen, so we're going to get into it right now. Now, earlier today, we did a video, and we were talking about some of the withdrawal limits and different stuff that are being imposed in futures trade. The initial numbers were, I think, a minimum of $200 and then a maximum of $10,000 on the withdrawal capped at twice a day. So $20,000 a day maximum you were able to take out. As soon as that launched, boy, was there a uproar. And it wasn't too big, big of an uproar, but I did see one of the main leaders on the Facebook group. And he was kind of pleading his case. He said, well, for those people that are putting in like $100 at that 1% level, they got to wait like 90 days just to take anything out. And I thought about that. I was like, how is that? But then I thought about it. You're doing your $100. You're getting 1% on that. And it's a 20-day contract. So if we go to the homepage here, say we went to the homepage, use this calculator, right? And excuse me for the math. Y'all don't have to stay for the math. Y'all can fast forward. But I just thought this was interesting because it didn't click for me at first. So total return on an investment of $100 is $120. That's still not enough to withdraw at the $200 level. So then you have to put $120 in again for another 20 days. Business days, mind you, which is a whole month. Now you're at $144. Total return. That's still not enough. So you get in 144, another contract roll around. Like I said, that's still not enough. You're getting your, you're getting your principal back along with your earnings of $28, which is the total daily earning of $1.44. And of course, you know, this is not, this, this platform is for people that want financial freedom. And you putting in $100 is a start. Let's be honest, it's a start. And it's cute. And I'm not trying to de belittle anybody's $100 because I understand I'm talking to people all over the world. But let's be real. Generational wealth, I don't care where you are in the world. I don't believe that $100 is going to get you generational wealth. Generational wealth is a big statement, a bold statement. We don't even know that futures trade can provide the opportunity to create General wealth, uh, uh, generational wealth. We're trying to find out, of course. We ain't scared to find out. But like I was getting back to the point, a person would not have been able to withdraw if they got in at $100, which there is a minimum of $100, all right? And then, of course, there are some people who get referral commissions out the craziness, even crazier than me, Right? And they're, they could be pulling in $10,000 a day or, or $20,000 a day just in referrals, not let alone their own personal investment, whatever that may be. So to cap them at $20,000 of withdrawals a day, I'm sure they weren't too happy about that, especially if they put in a crap load of money. But, of course, you're still able to get $20,000 now, so a person like me ain't going to trip about that. So let's get back to the initial statement I made in the beginning of the video. 
Dylan Carnell, one of the most accommodating leaders. He has decided to give a final revision to that withdrawal change. And I want to bring it up here. It's on YouTube. You can watch the video he just posted. But as you can see, he has changed it to a $100 minimum. What that means is if you put in that minimum of $100 or $50, I think the minimum is actually $50. But you cannot withdraw till you get a hundred dollars. So, whatever you whatever you at, this is it. Okay, if you have to compound that fifty dollars and hope and pray that it comes back around to be able to do so, then you better start praying. All right, because I like these changes. I'm not gonna come. To, I'm not gonna come at these changes because I actually like them. Here we go. A hundred dollar minimum to withdraw. Ten thousand dollar minimum uh, maximum in each withdrawal. Right, so you can't just come in here and withdraw fifteen thousand dollars. You have to withdraw ten thousand dollars and then five thousand dollars. All right, which brings me to my next point: no daily limit. And especially for those people that got into that twenty thousand dollar plan, let's say you're one person that wants to take all that money out. You just say, "I'm rich. <laughs> I turn twenty into forty in ten days. I ain't got to do another thing in my life. Whatever." <laughs> there are some crazy people that think like that. Trust me. For those people, you have to just do four transactions of $10,000. There's no daily li limit on how many times you can max withdraw or withdraw, period. Say if you had $5,000, then $2,000, you, you get a referral commission of $1,000, then you get a referral commission of $500. they are not going to tell you how many times you can withdraw in a day which I love because you never know when a referral commission is going to come. And my personal recommendation is if you want to be able to take that out as soon as you can and get that process going, you should do that. You should be able to do that. And I'm glad that Dylan, this guy right here with the freeze frame on his face, <laughs> shout out to you, Dylan. He's been very accommodating. So he's given everyone an opportunity. He's listening. Well, here's one of the main things that I love about what Dylan's doing. He's listening to the community, to the people on the Facebook page that have their questions and answers and all that different stuff that may get repetitive and annoying to me. But he's the leader, so he has to deal with that. <laughs> he's doing it. And I'm pleased to see it because... It kind of reminds me of that very first time that I got into a platform. And I was spoiled, I think. I think I was spoiled with my first platform. And some of you may not have even heard of the platform called Watermine. I got in in the middle to the end. I got to ride that way for three months. It was a pretty fun ride. It's what taught me a lot about these platforms. But I remember how I felt. I felt like I could trust it. Felt like it was going to be here for the long haul because I was naive. It was my first ever platform. I didn't even know they could go away. But now I know better. And I'm not saying anything negative about futures trade. I, this is actually a positive that I'm bringing up because this is like how I felt times two. I actually have a face. There's someone I can talk to. If I wanted to schedule a Zoom call with Dylan, I could probably hit him up on Telegram and be like, yo, I want to do a Zoom call for whatever reason. I'm not that type of guy because I think he has a lot going on on his own and he has a whole YouTube channel that he brings all the information on. So I don't have to like interview him or anything like that to try to fish information out of him. Um, I'm trusting him to update his YouTube page with his vision, with his plan, with the different things going on, with this trading, with tutorials and all that stuff. Because I understand the work that that takes to put out daily content, even weekly content. So anyway, I'm kind of derailing because I need to go back in here and do a withdrawal, actually. <laughs> but I wanted to show you guys just exactly what um, the new and final withdrawal changes are, okay? If you need to go watch that video on YouTube, please go do that. Take the time to go do that, all right? I'm going to play around in this exchange. I got some stuff to exchange here. 
I'm going to exchange it all into Bitcoin while I'm talking to you guys, which is an amazing thing to be able to just do that. Exchange right here on the platform for a minimal fee of 1% which is the lowest I've seen in a platform, actually, to date. In a platform's exchange, anyway. So, we've got $5,180 to withdraw. I want to go into withdrawal profits, and I still have 4488 pending. We're going to just add on to that. So, when it finally comes, I hope it just comes all at one time. That would be great. And I'm going to cut the platform some slack. Dylan has to do a whole lot, and he's manually processing these transactions um, to our wallets. So I'm very patient, okay? As long as people do what they say and they stay consistent, I'm very patient. This is probably the longest I've had to wait for a withdrawal. I'm not going to lie to y'all. But it ain't been 24 hours yet. And we just had some withdrawal changes. So I want to give that some time to settle in too. You know what I'm saying? Because just earlier today, I was trying to do a withdrawal, and they said you can only do two in a day. So I'm glad that that's no longer there. That's a positive. And um, this is one of those situations where when we see saved, and I've talked about this a lot, when a platform starts and they're doing instant, which this did not do instant when it started. So I, this is what it did when it started. It went into saved. And it's been paying for me. And for you and for everyone involved in futures trade since that day. Just a quick reminder, I've been in here since November the 27th, 2021. So I've been in here for a little while, almost two months now. I'm happy with what's going on. I put some big skin in the game. This is the most skin in the game I've put in any platform. All right? 8,800. I must have had a deposit. One of my one of my uh, deposits, one of my micro deposits, must have um, already matured because I used to be eighty nine. Now it's eighty eight, right off of eighty nine. It's not very far from eighty nine. So I've withdrawn eighty eight thousand dollars. After this pending goes through, it'll be closer to a hundred thousand dollars that I've withdrew from this platform. And I ain't even that ain't even that ain't even scratching the sur surface of what my personal investment was. That's through bonuses that this platform has given us when we promote, um, you know, referral commission plan that you're able to grow through. You start at a certain level, and once you reach a certain turnover, you start unlocking some levels, y'all. I'm trying to tell you. You start unlocking these levels. It's a different. I got people on my level six and level five that are going crazy. Crazy. But that's all because of what I started, not because of necessarily what I'm doing right now. It's not all about what you do. Sometimes it's about what you start and being a pioneer and being willing to take those arrows in the front and in the back. Pause. <laughs> Let's, um, I want to do one more thing. I want to show some gratitude to the BOJ team. I've been doing this for the last couple episodes, and I enjoy doing this because it's really awesome to see. Guys, we have accomplished $1.3 million worth of turnover in this platform. We have brought through Futures Trade, through uh, uh, to Futures Trade, through the BOJ referral link, some way or another, down six levels and probably even further than that if they unlock those. We have a total turnover of $1.3 million. Yes. Got to clap it up for that. If there's anywhere you clap it up, it's for that. And look at the numbers. There's only 74 of my first level people that are active. I think that's just first level. Only 74 of you. Over 100 of you have signed up and haven't done a thing. You're just sitting here watching us pull this money out of this platform. I'll never understand it. But uh, if you're out there, pull them splinters at your butt and get off the bench. All right? 
This is BOJ. If you like this content, make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And if you want to be notified about everything going on here at BOJ, make sure you hit the notification bell as well. It's your boy, Gerald from Baker Gerald. Please put your 2FA on all your platforms that will allow you and your websites. I mean, uh, your uh, wallets. <laughs> your wallets. <laughs> because crypto is a wild, wild west. And if you ain't strapped, you're bound to get hacked. Ask me how I know. It's not very fun. I will see you all in the next daily video. This is a futurestrade.io dot io futures trade dot io update all right oh, let me get myself together i'll see y'all on the next one peace out